Welcome back, everybody, to the next installment of Games from A to Z. This time we are playing C is for Capsized. It is a game by Alien Trap, and it's I picked it up on Steam. It's got an 80 Metacritic review. Uh, it's in the genres of action indie, and uh, I had a fun time playing it. It's a pretty great little game, and I'm going to let you enjoy the introduction. Yes, this is what we are playing today, and uh, we're jumping right into it. I did play a little bit of this before I started recording it, just to make sure that I can have an understanding of what the heck I was supposed to do. We're going into Alien 1 Crash, or uh, <laughs> we are going into Epa, like, uh, Level 1 Crash Site, Alien World. Move with WASD, pretty standard for keyboard mouse controls, aiming with mouse obviously it seems. Um, now, I should know that this is post-commentary. I did record this, uh, obviously, a while back when I'm doing the recording of the commentary after the fact, just to make sure, because there was a couple parts that were a little wonky. The game has it does have a few little bugs. Um, you can see that we've got a little gun here that is some sort of like a gravity, like, grabbing gun, like a, like a grappling gun. And uh, it also fires here, and we were fighting off some of these little alien guys here. I don't know what they're called, what their names are, but they're crazy little, like, uh, little, they, they, they chase you and they eat you. And it's ridiculous, it doesn't feel great, but you can take rocks and smash them like that, which is always satisfying to me. Uh, using our hook, you can also pull things like this to move them around, and that's how you kind of work your way through this 2D world. Uh, so right now, we're basically just trying to survive and, uh, and live after crash landing on this alien planet. The story does evolve from there. There's also a arcade mode if you just want to see how long you can survive against like endless waves of monsters or whatever else. There's that kind of stuff in there too in the arcade mode. There's a couple different modes. I'm trying to grab those health things, but it looks like I'm already full. It's weird though because the health meter looks like I'm a bar down in the bottom uh, left there. So I don't know. It's just a little awkward. Um, but it looks like we are full on health, so I'm not too worried about it. We just picked up an extra life. It shows us to use our hook here uh, to cross this little pit. So grabbing that right there and jumping right across. Any more enemies around here? Let's see if we can sneak through. There's that little spiky thing. I don't know what that's called. Gravity beam? Is that what that was? Gravity ram. Come down here, get the extra kills and might as well anyway. And I think that's dead now. Excuse me. So yeah, check this out. I played like three levels or so of it. Um, it's a pretty fun game. I've been enjoying it. It's... Uh, Unfortunately, there are some things that I I find a little annoying. It does have some crash points on it that are pretty common, it sounds like, uh, been reported by other players. It's got some some issues with not being able to resize and customize some of the like resolutions, which is why you're seeing some black bars, unfortunately, is because I couldn't really get the right resolution to take uh, for recording, which may or may not just be me, um, but I did hear some other people complaining about pos or not being able to do that, so, uh, looks like maybe I'm not the only one. And what- I, I don't know what this object is. I have no idea what this little glowy object is. Uh, so I think we're gonna just gonna try to carry it with us. I'm quite- I'm quite confused by what it does. I couldn't find anything for it to fit into, I couldn't find anything like that, but let's go ahead and break through these bro uh, these blocks here take this rock and that's not gonna go through here I was hoping to push it through and just like force through and break all this shit but that didn't work that just busted up can we pull it out nope let's just go ahead and break it down with some charge shots and some fast shots hook that thing we can pull that out and just drag it through there and get back behind there now okay I guess we can't push it through either just grab it we're just gonna run it all the way out and then we'll just have to loop back up and around and break through that little uh, top portion to get through, it looks like. Whee! I do like that you can uh, like just stick on the walls. Don't break that little pod. Oh, God. There we go. Looks like it's starting to break. We should be able to sneak through there pretty quick. That rock goes through. We are good. I didn't even need to come back down here. I don't know why I'm doing... Oh, grabbing that. That's right. Carry this on through. We're going to make it through. We're going to take this thing to the end, damn it. 
switch weapons, either middle mouse uh, scroll or one, two, three, four, that kind of keybinds to switch your weapons. Busted that little nest up. Alt fire, hold down left, or uh, I'm sorry, right click, and it shows you the alternate fire of the different weapons. Plus an extra life. We grabbed our little uh, thing there. Wall jump. Excuse me, yawning there. You just saw the wall jump. Uh, you can basically just stop yourself on a wall at any time. You just hold A or uh, whatever direction to it. Oh boy, that was almost a screw up at losing our little thing there. I was hoping we could launch it up and over, but it didn't quite work. Thankfully, we didn't lose it. So, uh, what do we got here? Recharging jetpack fuel. Oh, nice. We got our jetpack now. Press space to use your jetpack. And oh, we got some enemies up there. That's true. Let's see if we can finish them off. Use our little glowy orb to finish the queen off and kill these little stragglers up pretty nice and easy. We are still full health, so that's not something we have to worry about. Moving on up. Oh, what is this? Big old bug there. Might as well kill him with that thing. Oh. Looks like we may have found something back here as well. If we can not put the rock on top of us, that'd be great. Knock that up and out. Gosh, we're just screwing this whole thing up. There we go. See if we can sneak over. We should be able to sneak in there, I think. Okay, fair enough. Let's just take this thing over a little more. There we go. That'll be fine. Ah! Kill it! Sneaking on in, we picked up uh, a secret and picked up some other good stuff there. I think that was fuel. I think that's what those little things are, fuel. The little dots. Or maybe it's ammo. It totally could be ammo for your gun, actually, now that I think about it. Come on, we can do this. Fly, little buddy. Push out from that, and oh god! That little energy ball has come in handy. Let us kill a few of these bigger groups easily enough by just blasting them. Slow it down, grab that. Come on, come with us! You are not getting left behind! Oh god. We're getting shit. Oh, it's up there. That's an area that I hadn't seen before. Can we launch up there? Use our gravity ram and our jetpacks to launch us all the way up, and we did pick up a little extra. Looks like, oh god, enemies! Forgot about those little guys. Those guys are vicious, they just come right at you. Can we get this out of here? Did we lock this behind here? Damn it! I think we can get this. Come on, grab that thing with a hook. We can do this. Okay, not going that way, apparently. Take it up and out. Now we've got our prize. Let's head up and out of here. Oops. Don't want to get caught on that. Up and there. Oh, actually, we made it right to the end. Here we go. Hooray! Level one complete. We've made it out of this neck of the woods. Our runtime was six minutes, 36 or 34 seconds. Zero deaths. Difficulty was normal, so we did have negative one star for that. Secrets, we found half of them, apparently. A half of a star. Uh, 20 enemies killed, 304 shots fired. Let's go into the second level, Abduction. You can see them already on the map because I did them already. A little while back. Oh no, the Abduction! Locate endangered crewmate. He's getting chased by natives. We'll help you, buddy! We'll help you! Yeah, that stuff is ammo, looks like. And we got some new enemies here. That little guy looks like some sort of like a crazy alien wolf looking thing. Whatever you want to call it, I don't know. We got some more enemies fleeing about us. These crazy little like bloat fly looking things or whatever. I don't know if that's what even what bloat fly looks like. That, that's what the name or what the what the image invokes for me to name it anyway. <laughs> bloat flies. Um, okay, so let's see where we can go from here. We got a few more little flies down here and a couple little weird plants on the walls. I don't know what the hell those are. See if we can kill those. Oh, we're slipping. We're slipping. Yep, those are killable, so let's kill those down. I don't really know what they do. Something there. Let's lift this up here with a gravity hook. And it looks like there's an enemy right down there. Or a little group of enemies, I should say. Not enough room to get the momentum to crush them with the rock. And unfortunately, we just moved it for him. That's okay. It gave us enough time to kill him, though, with our, with our rifles, so that's good. And that crazy alien wolf thing again. Let's go ahead and finish him off here nice and quick. Oh, we won't be able to gra uh, grab him with our gravity hook. That's not gonna work. Just kill him! Come on! Charge beam! There we go. And okay, so we got a little, uh, something down here. We got some more ammo over there. We got a rock that moves. 
Um, I don't really see much else. We slide that along the bottom. I didn't. I don't think you see anything. Ah, spike trap! Kill it. So those things will move. They have feet on their on the bottom side of them. Then they can move along the ground. They can also attach to roofs and fall on you when you go by. Um, but their spikes, if you hit them, are quite painful. Oh god! There we go. Another little wolf thing done. What is this? Oh, that's an extra life. Okay. Let's see, where can we go now? What can we unlock? Let's go back here, let's grab this down. And uh, we're gonna see if we can get behind it. There we go. Almost let that fall back into place, but it looks like it slid away, that's okay. We'll just leave that there, I guess. Or we'll try to reposition that. I think I'm, what I'm trying to try to do is jump up to that the one right above here. I think I need a little good little platform for it. Let's slide this over like that. That we uh, that way we have a little bit more of a ramp there to get up into that other area. Enemy in there? Can we hit it? Oh, it's a spike trap. Yep, there we go. All done. Grabbing everything. It looks like we picked up a new gun. Some sort of like a uh, like a uh, powder thing there. Did I see? They're shooting out like a like a like a cloud. I don't know. That's a nest. Did we get everything in it? Looks like we killed all the occupants of that nest. We're not going to be able to get to that secret area. It must be from the other side. Let's go ahead and head back out, but we did get up there, so that's good. Looks like, yeah, there is a secret and more ammo. <laughs> Can we jump up there? Use those air, those jetpacks, damn it. Or just wall jump it. That's fine, too. We picked up some more ammo, and yes, we did pick up that extra secret. Two of two found for this level. Come on, you got jetpack fuel mog. Remember, buddy. Remember. There we go, I just really like the wall jumps, it's kind of fun, I knew I could get there. Don't lose it, don't lose it! Break the path, kill the bloatflies. And the backlash of that charge did actually hit us in the explosion, but that's okay, it didn't do us much damage, we're fine. Climbing on up. We got a few enemies up in this area, including some of these wallflowers, whatever the hell they are. I don't know the actual names of these weapon or these enemies, so I'm just making shit up. I hope you don't mind. Uh, jumping on up, let's do this thing. Wall jump. Pick up some more ammo, grab ourselves some health recovery, but there are some enemies, so unfortunately we didn't do as well as I thought. There we go. Pull the stick out of here. We're good. Clear that place out. Now we can't get through there. There's no secret cuts through the wall, so that's fine. We'll just head on out this way. Surf that stick all the way down. Alright, what do we got here? First sign of the pra the primitive natives looks like here. I don't want to say primitive, that's just a bad choice of words. They got weapons. Not that primitive. Can't break break through there um, at this point, so that's fine. My gravity blasted a little something, but we popped it back into place. Looks like definitely got to get through there. So let's go ahead and push through here. Sorry about the little cut. I spent a little bit of time. I accidentally broke that door. It's supposed to fall down behind us, uh, right behind us there when it comes through and block us in this little area, but it didn't fall through. You can see me trying to mess with it, seeing if I can get it to fall back down. But yeah, it's not happening. So okay, whatever. So let's just head on up. Oops, got caught there on the edge. Stop it. There we go. Enemy pod there. I think we should be able to kill them nice and easy. It's those little runners. Those guys are ridiculous. They're so fast. And there's usually groups of four. So they jump at you pretty quick. Let's head on up again. And take that out. Uh, oh, sorry. That must have been the cut where I was just messing around or went to go explore elsewhere. Heading on up. And let's cut through here and finish off these, these uh, natives and get to the end. And save our crewmate. We are going to find him, damn it. We're not going to let him die. <laughs> Knock him down there. Can we kill him? We can with an extra shot. Now, there it goes. See, that's supposed to fall right down in there. But I think because I shot it with a gravity ram, it uh, screwed it up initially. And, uh, yeah, we didn't get that response like we should have. Able to finish off that little guy with a charged shot as we move our way through here. There's another secret area up there. Can we sneak through here? We sure can. Picked it up. Two of two. Did, was that really just one of two last time when I read that? Am I crazy? I must have just read that. This is a small preview window. Maybe I did just misread that as a one of the two previously secret uh, places found when we found the first one here. A long run on sentence. Kill that guy. Come on, he's dead already. Now let's go. No, he's not dead. Oh my god. Alright. Let's move on. Picked up some more ammo. We are doing good on full health. No need for anything there. Let's break this barrier and continue our way through. Don't see any enemies rushing down to us yet, but there they are. We got some of the natives. We got a few hits on us with this little arrow, so let's finish him off nice and quick. There we got another one coming up the way here. Let's see if we can get him off with this charged blade arrow shot that's already ready to go. 
And we are able to, but his little buddies and Blowfly friends helped him out a lot there and got us a few extra hits. We are down below half health at this point, but I think we can do this. A little triple shot there we were able to avoid and fire back with our charged beam. And we found our fellow crewmate's crashed pod. Is he here? Lots of natives, but I don't see him yet. And it looks like we are at the end of the level. We will find him in the next one, I hope. Pushing on. Level 2 completes. Running along through the woods. Complete time, 6 minutes, 58 seconds, 0 deaths. Difficulty of normal, negative 1 star. But we found all the secrets, so it made up for it. We got ourselves, looks like 7 stars. 33 enemies killed, 786 shots fired. Moving on to the Warren, level 3. Locate endangered crewmate. And we are going to be infiltrating their base. Flashlight is F, we'll turn that on. Good to know. For these darker levels. Oh, arrow already from the darkness. Got us with two of them. Let's hop on down there. There we go, we got him in the dark. We were able to see him well enough. Is that we're going to back back up, or is it just going to hang out and let us come back down there? Oh, we got another one up top, too, so that's good to know. Let's move it on up and fire. We didn't get to kill them both. Oh, God, the spikes on us. Oh, man, I died. I can't even believe it. Thankfully, the respawn's not too bad. Let's head on back in. We've got our flashlight ready already. We don't need to keep worrying about that. Oh, another weapon type. Let's move on over this way, see if we can uh, kill him. Ah! And a big blow fly. Finish him off. We got that rapid fire. We're good. We don't need the health yet. We're doing fine. We already died and respawned with full health. So who needs more, right? Ah, let's grab this weapon. What is this one? I wonder. Oh, we gotta find out. It's like a little like rocket launcher type thing. Like uh, what is it? What is this thing on there? Blast carbine. Is that what that says? Is that our base one? Did we run out of ammo already? Where the hell's our ammo? Oh, I think we switched to our other weapon. We're just on our base and using our charge shot. So it's not the blast carbine. Sorry, it's just a little a little blurry in this preview window when I'm recording the post commentary. Not too bad though. Finish him up with a charge shot. Moving on in. Looks like somebody's trying firing some stuff at us, so we got an enemy over there. Break open that crate. We didn't find much though, so let's see if we can light this guy up. Where is he? There's a there's a fly up there that we can't hit just yet. But he's coming at us now. I'm able to finish him off nice and quick. We've got a few up there, but we got another native. Uh, looks like two of them, possibly. Maybe more. Off screen if we can see him, but I don't know. We've got one right there. Finish him off with a nice charge shot. we got another. Ooh. Yeah, they launched something at us there. A little box. Let's see if we can get him with that. Looks like we may have connected and got the first one. we got one more up there that was able to hit us from there. Jesus. Talk about a sniper shot. There we go finish him off we're moving along along the top of this level at this point we got some flies coming at us we were able to finish him. oh god the big one coming at us thankfully the big charge shot uh, stops their momentum a bit and lets us get a little bit of a breather okay we got some more enemies over here let's see if we can finish them nice quick there we go we got more ammo and health health we don't need but ammo we could probably take but we're just been using our blast carbine so we probably don't really need it honestly where are more enemies? Oh, there's some blue flies. Oops. Didn't even notice him in the mess there. There's one up on the hill there. Big guy. Looks like a lot of armor. We're not going to be able to shoot through there. We're going to get like a shotgun of some sort. There we go. First shot, charge shot in there to him. Able to clear him back a little bit and push forward. A little more damage. Let's go ahead and take a look down here though. What do we got? Looks like this is all backed up. Uh, we'll have to break it from the other side, I think. We're not going to be able to get through there, I don't believe. And I don't think we're going to have much luck moving much of this. Come on! Come on! I don't think we're going to get that through there. That's just a lost cause. Why don't we go explore some of the lower section of this area? See what we can find. Maybe we can find a way through. Broke that little spike guy out of there with the, with the uh, boulder there. But not killed him, it doesn't look like. Oh no, he's still stabbing us. Definitely not killed him. Fires right through there. We can get him. Charge shot. Finish him off. Ooh, that got the ba uh, back blast on us. Boulder's rolling down now. We should be good. We're going to crush this guy if we can. Come on! There we go. Didn't kill him, but at least we broke through the little area there. Ooh, that's nice. The charge shot was enough to break him back there and kill him. We got an alien wolf. Let's finish him off if we can real quick. Gosh, I hate that we can climb on the ceilings. It's just ridiculous to me. 
And looks like we may have some enemies along this side too. It looks like just a little spike. Let's go ahead and finish him off. Might as well for the kill experience, right? I guess it didn't help that we took a damage there, but that's okay. Oh god, got a couple of natives here. What are we looking at? Let's see if we can kill them both off here. They are both finished. I don't know. Grab that. And I think we're good, actually. I think I did kill them all. Take that. We got uh, some more equipment and stuff around here. Some more items, I should say. Not equipment. That's weird. Pop down here. Let's take a quick peek. We'll finish off this spike trap. Grab the ammo. We're good on health. What do we got back there? It looks like something else. Some more jetpack fuel. There we go. Launching up. And we got a secret found. So that's good. Picked up a secret. We are full health. Doing well. Let's move on forward. Whoa. Knock that down there, provide us a little bit more room, and pick ourselves up the extra health life. Or the extra life, I should say. Grab that extra uh, ammo. And, oh god, passive creature freaking me the shit out. Okay. Jump across here. We're doing good on all that shit. And move down to this section that we haven't really been in yet. See what we can find. Come on. We got a couple of different weapons here. We got some enemies down here. Let's see if we can finish them off some of our weapons, but I'm really partial to this Blast Carbine. It's a really damn good weapon. It works really damn well, I think. God, we got a lot of those little crazy things. Let's use the, the friggin... I don't know what to even call this. What does that say? I can't even read it. It almost looks like like some sort of like a flamethrower, but with like ice cold, like... I don't know. It'd be like the ice equivalent of a, <laughs> of a flamethrower. Bust that down there. Let's see if we can let these blocks fall out. There we go. Grab that with the hook. Can we pull out the other one there with the hook? Whoa! Almost brought that right down on the back of our heads. Jesus. Okay, last but not least, let's pull this other one out. Uh, come on. Come on! Come on down the hole! Actually, that's probably like a horrible angle. If I'm trying to like tip it up, that's a horrible spot to try to grab it from. Me to that top corner. Let's gravity ram that back in there, but I think what we're gonna do is just go kill this guy and go around because we can break through that other shit, and it's out of the way of blocking it now. Kill him with that secondary shot of that new gun. Oh god, don't do that. Blast Carbine should be fine for this. No backlash on Blast Carbine. Moving down, we are past that blockade now. Let's take a peek down here. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! I'm sorry, friend. I'm so sorry. I wish there was a way I could help you. I'm so sorry. But thank you guys for watching. This has been your Captain Mog speaking. If you liked what you saw or wanted to check out some more of this game yourself, check it out in the description below. There's links to the stores you can pick it up at. Um, as well as I would appreciate if you liked or learned something new about this video, hit that like button. I'd love to have that feedback. And if you're not part of the Mog Squad already and a subscriber, hit that subscribe button and join our Steam group, the Mog Squad. And come play some games with us and your other fellow viewers. We'll see you guys next time. Cheers.